Victoria is filled with fascinating cultural venues, including the Royal BC Museum and the Art Gallery of Greater Victoria. But it can be challenging for a family to afford visiting these local treasures, unless, of course, they have a Greater Victoria public card, libra public library card, rather. Veronica. This is the drawing room. This would be the room or, that the ladies would have come into after dinner. Built uh, for coal baron Robert Dunsmuir in the late 1880s, Craig Derrick Castle is a fascinating site to visit. So much of Victoria's history here. I mean, whether you're talking about the Dunsmuirs in the Victorian era or the military hospital from 1919 to 1921, University of Victoria started in here. So, I mean, there's so many community connections, whether you're interested in the past or closer to the present and the castle is especially spectacular at this time of year. Christmas is on. There will be some live music. If you're going to do it, it's a great time to try it out. And if you have a Greater Victoria Public Library card, you can hop on the wait list for a free e-pass to visit the castle. We're very pleased that the Craig Derrick Castle is now part of the program. The program began in 2011 when the Art Gallery partnered with GVPL to provide a family of four with a pass checked out from the library. It's since expanded from Art Gallery of Greater Victoria to the Royal BC Museum, the Robert Bateman Centre, and believe it or not, Saanich um, Parks and Rec. You can actually borrow a pass to go to Saanich Recreation Centres. Craig Derrick Castle is the first venue with an electronic pass. We just want to get people into the castle whenever we can, so it seemed like a, a wonderful opportunity. I think we've had 11,000 um, since the program started in terms of using our various passes, and my understanding is we already have about 250 holds for, for the castle. Admission for a family of four to the castle is $35, so for many, it's worth the wait. Libraries are all about discovery and information and connecting people to the facts that they need. Once they borrow the pass, and many people become very engaged, then they'll return, which is kind of a great opportunity to expose some of our local treasures um, a little bit more broadly. Visit a branch of GVPL to hop on a wait list for your favourite venue. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation, celebrating 80 years of connecting people who care with causes that matter.